Lunar eclipse occurs when the Earth blocks the sunlight falling on the surface of the moon. This cosmic event occurs only when sun, earth and the moon are exactly or very closely aligned in Suzuki. Suzuki is a straight line configuration of three or more celestial bodies in space. Lunar eclipse occurs only on full moon days. Then why don't we see the lunar eclipse on every full moon day? The reason is the moon's orbit is not exactly horizontal but tilted to 5 degrees. So the earth, sun and moon are not always aligned. But when they do get aligned, shadows are formed on the surface of moon. A larger, lighter shadow known as penumbra and a smaller, darker shadow known as umbra. Atumbra is the region where the body is not able to stop the light due to size and distance from the light source, thus giving an annular ring. There are three types of lunar eclipse. The first is the total lunar eclipse when the moon, earth and the sun are perfectly aligned with each other and earth blocks out sunlight completely, that is, the moon falls in umbral region. Total lunar eclipse turns the moon in blood red color because light from the earth atmosphere scatters red light inwards to the moon while the blue light is scattered outwards to the moon. It is the same reason why sun appears red at time of sunrise and sunset. Suppose if we remove the earth's atmosphere, then no light will scatter and moon will appear a complete black. The second type is the partial lunar eclipse in which only some part of moon falls in umbral region. This happens when the sun, earth and moon do not align perfectly. And the last one is penumbral lunar eclipse in which the moon lies in penumbral region only. In this state, the moon's brightness will be only reduced slightly. Unlike solar eclipse, lunar eclipse can be seen from naked eyes. First lunar eclipse of this year, 2020, will happen on 10th, 11th January night. This will be penumbral lunar eclipse and can be seen from all over Europe, Asia, Australia, Africa, etc. The moon is moving away from the earth at the rate of 3 to 4 centimeters per year. In the next millions of years, the moon will not be so close that we can see the total lunar or solar eclipse.